Hi everybody, my name is Gina. I've been working to put together these remote learning kits for everybody and I thought I would send a little message trying to explain everything so it is the easiest for you guys. Um, I just did a preschool um, video and now I'm going to do an infant and toddler video. So as an infant and toddler child, you received these documents. Now let's back up a little bit so you understand those. In your kits, you got a binder like this, infants and toddlers. Your very first page is going to have an introduction. And then you're going to have a Zoom information. Please let your teachers know if you are not sure how to get on Zoom or if you're having any trouble with that. Um, it is a great way to communicate with your teachers. You, if you have next, a non-federal share calendar. These are very, very important. Um, what they do is they help us keep track of your time and then we can take that time and use it as a payback basically um, for having a ch free childcare program. Then you can get a certain amount back. We get a certain amount back. Um, so they help us out a lot. So please make sure you fill those out. And then it goes right into your Mighty Minutes. And these are all games and activities that you can do at home and your teachers will be doing um, in the videos as well. So feel free to go along with us there. And then there's learning games. And again, there are activities that you can do at home um, or to some teachers might do with you on um, a video chat. Okay, and then you have the book discussion cards. Okay, those are the cards that go along with the books that your teachers will be providing for you. So, infants and toddlers, then let me show you right now what we're doing. Okay, so you have a packet just like this and depending on if your child is an infant or if you scroll down here, there's the toddler. So we're going to focus on both just so I can explain to you where everything is. Here is the date up at the top here. You have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Um, we do creative curriculum. That is the curriculum that we teach your child in the centers. And creative curriculum is the Highlights Hello books. So you have a printout or you should have gotten a printout from your teachers of the Hello Highlights that you would need. I'm focusing on next week, which would be the third week of the program. Um, just so you guys know what you're doing. Here. So you would be using the Hello Highlights book number 22. Um, let me just show you an example here. Here is the Hello book number 24. It would have the 22 right there on the hair. And the discussion card is Playful Puppies. So in your cards part, you would look for discussion 22. And it will say playful puppies it is actually the very first one here. I know you can't see that very well, but it gives you examples and things to do with your book. Okay, so in the book, it would have the playful puppies read aloud that you can do with your child at home, as well as maybe your teacher will do it on through the YouTube channel or live Zoom. Then you have learning game 44. So you would look in your book. So let me stop screen sharing so I can show you the binder again. And we'll go to learning game 44. And the numbers are just at the top here. I will show you in just one second. 
So right there is your learning game number. And this says talking about feelings. So what you can do is talk to your child about feelings. Um, and it says what you do right there in the learning game. Watch for movements when your child feels strongly about something and then describe her emotion or her feeling. But guess what? It can be a him too. <laughs> for example, when he jumps up and down at the sight of a bunch of balloons, you might say, you're so excited about those balloons. And again, the tone of your voice helps a lot. So those are things that you can do at home or your teacher might be doing them with you. And then the next thing, if I screen share with you real quick, the next thing it says is a mighty minute and silly animal walk. So again, you're gonna go to your binder, stay with me here, and go to number two, and the numbers are very hard to see on my copy here, but it's right here. And let me just explain the Mighty Minutes. So the Mighty Minutes that we have are on cards. So when we screenshotted them, we couldn't get the whole entire card on one screenshot. We had to take a little bit. So the bottom of the card um, on the first side says, change the animal, and then there's just a couple other lines that we missed over here. So it's the exact same card except for the bottom part. Um, that's why there's two of those. So that's Silly Animals Walk. And it says, hey, when you're doing a transition between activities, invite your child to copy you as you move like an animal. So say you were at the table eating and then you're done eating and it's time to go wash your hands in the bathroom or at the sink. You can move like an elephant and get your trunk out and move like an elephant to the sink. It makes it just a fun, easy way to move around your house. Um, ITC is intentional teaching card. You will not have those. The teachers actually have those um, and then they can do playful interactions with you. If you want to know what that is, or if you want to see the card, please talk to your teacher about getting that card and they can send it to you through Dojo or through your email. And then the mini themes, it has the standard there. And then there's a book, whoops, let me go back to screen sharing. So here's your standard. You don't really need to worry about that, but these are the lesson plans that the teachers have in the classroom as well. So we need those on there. Here is a book that you can watch if you go to that YouTube book. And in social emotional, you would talk to you, your baby while they are laying on the floor, making eye contact and telling them a story or reading to them. Um, what we did was each day we have something that we focused on. Monday's social emotional, Tuesday's math, Wednesday's reading, Thursday's art, and Friday's science. So that's why we have those different topics on the bottom there for you to work on. Um, and then the books um, are going to be on our website eventually. So bear with us in Vincent Toddler parents. Um, we are working on our website. If you go to just www.shchildservices.org, hit enter, here's our website. Um, if you haven't been on here yet, please try to come on here and see what's going on. We have a lot of great things that you can see. Um, come over here to the remote learning tab, click on that. And then we have information for parents. If you click on that, it explains our remote learning curriculum that we are doing. It gives you um, what's in your totes if you're an infant toddler versus a preschool. There's art kits and what's in each of them. Please make sure that your kit has everything. I know we've been um, working on getting more yarn and more paint. Paint should be in, so if you do not have paint, please contact your teacher. They should have paint for you now. 
Um, yarn is still on back order, so we are trying to get that in as soon as possible. Thank you for bearing with us. Um, everything else should be in your kits. Make sure that you have all of your supplies. And there's a big long list there of the art kits. And then here's just some pictures of your art supplies there, if you want to see that. Um, now, right now, this is geared, this calendar is geared towards the preschool families. Um, we are working on getting the infant and toddler information on here as well. So we were talking about the seventh here and we will be having your packets on here available on our website soon. So please be patient with us there. Um, and then Tyler, same concept. So if we go over here, here's the toddlers. Different things, maybe extended, maybe some harder activities for the toddlers that you can do and different activities there and then we can go on to the packet. So it says a gross motor activity. You can read different emotions off the feelings chart and have your toddler act them out with you. Um, here is the nutrition lesson that you can do okay, with your child. That's always fun. And then there's a how to wash your hands in your packet. All right, so if you have any questions on your packets or how to use them, please feel free to contact your teacher directly um, or you can email me. My email address is reginap at shchildservices.com. So if you need anything, let me know. Thank you very much for your time and I will see you again soon.